welcome to another beer review with the Beer Man. Today I bring you another beer from Decidious Brewing. They are based in Newmarket in New Hampshire. This is Be My Mind, coming in at 7%. Obviously it's a IPA. Um, looking at it, I call it a New England IPA, and where New Hampshire is, I'd call it a New England IPA. It's a New England IPA, so... <laughs> but anyway, yeah, um, the last beer from um, Decidious, Sm it wasn't much to the nose, but it tasted all right. Uh, I wasn't sure if I had the brewery before, and I looked in previous beers I've had, and apparently I had one of their beers in May, and I absolutely loved it. So, you know, high hopes that was just one of them beers that just wasn't overly pungent. So, yeah, it's a little closer to the beer, right? Now, in terms of looks, it is very, very standard... Juice bomby colour, um, a bit more on the darker side of orange if I had to say anything. Decent carbonation, uh, decent head retention as well. But with this glass you will, so it's kind of a plus point really. But um, it looks a really, really pleasant beer. Um, sediment is a little bit, but not too much. Don't see any floaties as such. It looks a really nice, fairly standard juice bomb really. So uh, let's give it a sniff, eh? Ooh! That is not subtle. That is that lemon and lime is a kicking. Oh, that lemon and lime is really, really good. In fact, but it's definitely that really quite sweet orange and peach, stone fruity, citrusy, tropically. I say a bit of pineapple cubes. The sweets. It's that slight sugary sweetness to this. I'm not really getting much else really. I'm not. I'm not saying. I'm not saying that's just this because it's quite a hefty whack. Of all them fruits, and it, and it smells really good. It's not smashing in the face, but it's letting you know I'm here, come to drink me. So, thy I shall will. Cheers. Tasty. Ooh, I like that. Straight off the bat, I like that. Again, lemon and lime, especially the lime side. Really dominant, and then you get the pithiness, you know, and the zests of them. But you also get every single aspect of the orange is the same. Um, I say really quite on um, like really quite sharp intensity of orange, but it's really pleasant. This general stone fruitiness, you know, the drink was that was really good. So, yeah, with the lemon and lime and the orange, you do get some melon. Pineapple, definitely. A whisper of mango, but not a lot. There's a bit of pine in there, definitely. Just it's not a lot, but it's like a little sprinkle of it. It just kind of just a little, little tickle of your taste buds. Yeah, that that second one was not as punchy as the first sip of. Yeah, just very tropical citrus fruitiness. I'd get more out of them. You do get some aspects of the stone fruit. Right. A peachy and apricotiness to it, and then that pine. Um, yeah, that's a that's a good beer. I like that. I like that a lot. Um, body wise, drinks really really well. Quite smooth, very easy to drink. Ten percent. So and it's that easy to drink. So, wow, wow, danger, danger. <laughs> High voltage. Yeah, really soft, very clean, and very easy to drink. Yeah, that's a, that's a nice beer. I like that one a lot. It needs a little bit of bitterness as well, mixed with the pine, just to balance everything out. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Rating is 4.25. It's the most 4.25 beer you'll ever see. <laughs> it's not world class, but I bloody like it. I like it a lot. Yeah, the serious. So far, I've had a 4.5, a 4, and a 4.25 now. So, yeah, you're more than happy with that with beers in general so yeah no faults anyway if you've had any beers from Decidious or you've had this beer before let me know drop me a comment and you know if there's any beers that I need to try and get if they ever come across or I can somehow get them um, let me know I'm definitely on my radar pretty, pretty good brewery from the three beers I've had so far yeah I'm quite pleased so Hey, hope you've enjoyed this review, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.